What it do, guys? Take out of money here. Let me give my fucking ass opinion and thoughts on Bleach Chapter 533. Pretty much the chapter happens off what happened from last week. In the chapter with Kurosaki Murasaki, Spirit Boring, the fucking Black Hollow, boom, in the fucking head. And the fucking Hollow's head is like fucking cracked. It's right side of his fucking face. And everyone is shocked to see this. Even Eisen is shocked. Like, that's very shocking to see him. I isn't very surprised about something because he you know, he always got that calm, cool, collected face. But after the Black Hollow gets his fucking head almost like destroyed and everything, it's about to explode self-destruction. But before that happens, Ishin rushes in and grabs the Hollow. And they, this big ass explosion on the next panel happens. That happens all the way in the sky. After this happened, pretty much Aizen and the others leave at this point and pretty much... He, he Sheen is on the ground pretty much and you know, he's pretty much banged up at this point. Pretty much Misaki sees him and pretty much you see that he's a Shinigami and pretty much she's he's wondering like who are you, like what's your name and everything and pretty much she says I'm gonna hear you and pretty much she's kind of hes hesitant a little bit about telling what she is because you know how Shinigami and Quincy are, they really don't really get along with one another. But she tells him who she is and that pretty much she's a Quincy. And relevant to see kind of Idi Ishin is pretty much, he was very relevant and kind of happy to see a Quincy for the first time. Like, he was very shocked and good. So, pretty much, wow, you're a Quincy? Wow, I've never really met one up close before or ever in my life. So, he's pretty much happy to meet a Quincy. And pretty much, she was thinking to herself, like, wow, he's very different from most Shinigami. I wonder if the other, other Shinigami are like him. Wrong. And quote unquote, what I mean by wrong, Captain Commander. He's a hard ass old man. He's too strict. He goes by the book too much. But rest in peace, Captain Commander Yamamoto. Pretty much after this, after this happened, pretty much time goes past, and we go back to Soul Society. We see bitch ass Tosin fucking having a bitch moment, saying, "Oh, the fucking hollow, you know, fucking uh, self destructed. All that work we put into this, blah blah blah." And pretty much we use a dead Shinigami to holify it and bring it to life and everything. Yeah, 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 a bitch ass Tosin. Like, when did, when did he become a bitch ass person? But Aizen comes in pretty much saying that pretty much their experiments, like, are not, like, through. Like, this was just, like, a step back. They still got other experiments that they're going to continue from this point on. Because seeing with the, seeing with the Quincy, Murasaki, Aizen still has more plans intended to do from this point on. Pretty much, Ishin is uh, summoned by the head captain commander, all the other captains. Don't see the other captains, but if you see a little glimpse, you'll see Captain Unahana, and you'll see Byakuya. So I'm guessing at some point in that time frame, um, Byakuya uh, became a captain as well and everything. But pretty much, Ishin gives his report to head captain Yamamoto, saying that pretty much what happened and everything, that Hollow, Hollow attacked them and everything, yada, yada, yada. That was all. That was all to his report. But Captain Commander has his, had his suspicions about Ishin saying, "Like, is that all there is to report? Is like, is there anything else that are you hiding or anything?" Ishin has this look on his face, but he's not gonna fucking open up and say anything about it. But he pretty much says, "No, there's nothing else to report, sir." So pretty much, it switches over for a second back to the human world. Misaki is, I guess, in school or some maybe. Quincy school training or something. And pretty much she's thinking to herself that thinking, she's thinking to herself the other night she, you know, was saved by Ishin and that she healed him. And she was thinking to herself like pretty much she seemed like a good person, a good Shinigami and wondering if more Shinigami more like him. And also at the same time Ishin in his barracks is thinking pretty much the same thing, just wondering. Well they both were wondering. Like well, hope wonder if I can get to know the person a lot more. Like, if y'all wanted to know each other more, why didn't y'all <laughs> exchange numbers, exchange names? Like, fucking knowing each, knowing each other as Quincy and Shinigami ain't gonna get you nowhere. Bada bing, bada boo. <laughs> but pretty much afterwards, it moves over to back to the human world. <coughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> Moves over to the human world where Misaki's, I guess, uh, leaving out of school with her friends, and pretty much they're having this, having this um, conversation about uh, Ryu getting one of her friends, saying pretty much, 
I wouldn't care if if you was my cousin. He makes me horny. That was shocking to fucking hear. Like, if you had a cousin, you would actually get horny. Wow, I got some twisted shit going in <laughs> bleach. Well, pretty much afterwards, that's that happens. Some some person we don't get to see the person is, but we see person with a uh, person with um, long fingernails, as a female bump into her, and as this passes, we see Kisuke. And pretty much, he looks back and wondering who that person was that you know bumped into. Musaki, Kurosaki. And that's how the chapter ends for 533. Overall, it was a good chapter. No fighting, nothing. Pretty much it was like a setup chapter for what's, what's going to happen in a few other, in the uh, coming up chapters of Bleach. Pretty much Aizen still doing his experiments and still, he's still developing what he can do more to make the holifying more complete and pretty much He's searching for Shinji and the others, because I'm guessing if he ever did find him again, I guess he would experiment on them even more. And seeing Kisuke in this chapter was a thumbs up. So I'm guessing we're starting to see what is the connection between Kisuke, Musaki, mm, Ishin, Ryugen, and all them. Also, I forgot to admit in the chapter, after Musaki um, was healing Ishin, and after it was done, up in the, up in the sky... We saw Ryugen in his uh, maid, and pretty much Ryugen was there with his spirit armor, and pretty much he came there for nothing, like, like he brought out his spirit armor pretty much for nothing, like really, that was a total waste. <laughs> but that's my thoughts, for, that's my thoughts and opinions for Bleach Chapter 5 Let me know what you thought of the chapter, rate, comment, and subscribe, and as always guys, have a blessed fucking day. Peace.